Hello, my name is David Lee, and this will be a tutorial on how to purchase tickets on the Colwell Public Transportation app. It's fast and easy to use, and you also get discounts for purchasing tickets via the app. You can download it on the Apple Store or the Google Play Store. Just type in K O R A I L, and it should be the first one that pops up. Now, let's get into the app. Oops. All right, sorry about that. Now here is the main screen, okay? Um, on the top left, you'll see a button called Tsingchagwan Yeme. This is the menu where you can choose the date and time of your ticket, the parting station and arrival station, and also the number of tickets you'll like to purchase. First, let's go choose a date and time right here. On the left is a date, and on the right is the time. It's on a 24-hour schedule. So let's say on the 25th, around 5 p.m. And that's when we want to depart, around that time. So to confirm in the bottom, it says June 25th, 2013, Huarul, which is Wednesday, uh, around 5 p.m. That's when we want to leave. So click Huagin in the bottom left, and we can continue. Then, let's go choose the departing station, Chubai Yuk, right beneath the date. Now let's click it, and you get to choose your departing station. I live in Taejeon, so we'll go find Taejeon right here. Click, and there it is. And let's say I want to go to Busan for the weekend. Um, I'll click Tochak Yuk, which is the arrival station. So click here, scroll down, try to find Busan. If I can't find it, just click right here and scroll all the way down until I see it. Busan. Now, my departing time will be around 5 p.m. on June 25th, this Wednesday. And my departing station will be Taejeon. My arrival station will be Busan. Now, on the bottom, this is where you get to choose the number of tickets you like to purchase. So, let's go click it. Here you'll see the word Odun. Odun means adult. Orini means ch a child, and Kyunglo is for the elderly. Now, you can choose up to nine tickets for the adult. Now, for this video, we'll just choose, let's see, just one ticket. Do not click the bottom link that says Harin Chuga. Uh, that's for special. Uh, offers for like different type of memberships if you have any so we'll just disregard that for now and just click backspace or if you have an Android um, click the backspace on the bottom near the home button now let's continue okay after everything is confirmed click Joy Hagi to continue on the left you'll see the type of trains the Mugunhua, the KTX, or there's also the Semaul. The KTX is the fastest in Korea, but it's also the most expensive. Mugunhua and Semaul is the cheapest, but it's also uh, one of the slower ones. It takes almost as twice as long as the KTX, but it's almost twice as or half the cost of the KTX. Now let's go to the next one. The second column will be the departing time. From Daejeon, there's a 5 o'clock, 5.03, 5.29, and the third column is the arrival time. For Busan, around 8.18 or 6.41, 7.13. And the last column is if it is available or not. If it is in green, it means you're good to go. You can buy a ticket there. But if it is a similar color to the one on the left, the red orangish color, that means it is not available. So since um, since all of these are green, let's just choose one of them. Let's go say departing time 5:03, arrival around 6:41, right here. Now this will just give you a little brief uh, description of where you're going, uh, what time you're going, when you're arriving, uh, what type of train you're gonna get, and what the train number is in this case 157 
and all you have to do is click the bottom left button right here Yak Hagi to continue. After you do this you'll go to this login page. Uh, the login is for Cora members but if you are not a Cora member and most of you guys probably won't be just click the top right tab. This is like a temporary login. So for the first row it says Sungmyeon which is name. You'll just choose a name and put it in but it has to be Korean. So if you do not have a Korean name just click in or type in la 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 and it will work. Done. Now next this is the second row. Chonapono. This is your phone number. So this will be the area code. Then you'll choose your phone number and put it in. And the third and fourth row is your password. You'll need this because later on when you exit the app, you might have to log back in to see your reserve tickets. So just put a simple password in. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And it has to be a five digit password. Okay? Now, after you've done all this, click Ibliok in the bottom right. And you'll continue. So, now here's another brief description of what you want. Taejeon departing 503, Busan arriving 641, KTX number 157. In the bottom here, you'll see Tukshi, Ibanshi, and sometimes there'll be a button here called Ipsak. Tukshi is first class seating. Ibanshi is general seating and Ipsak is freestanding. So, for this case, let's just choose a general seating. Ilbanshi and click in the bottom you'll see two options Trasak Suntek or Yeyak. Now Trasak Suntek is gives you the ability to choose a specific seat. So if you want an aisle seat, you can choose it like that, or if you want a window seat way in the back of the train, you can do that. Or if you choose Yeyak, that'll just randomize the seating for you. So uh, if you're really strapped on time, just click Yak and you'll just get a seat for sure. But in this case, let's go try to choose a specific seat. So try some tech. Now on the top, you'll see a cart number. So let's say I want to be in cart 7. And in the bottom, you'll see a list of seats. Okay. Now these two on the left will be on the left two sides and then these two on the right will be on the two sides and the middle will be the walking aisle. Now let's say I want to get a window C in the front. I'll choose one A. So one A has been chosen and click Yak once you have confirmed your seating. Now click Quagin to get rid of the notification and this is almost the final step. You'll see departure time 503, arrival time 641 for one person and it will cost 29,801. If you have confirmed everything, click Palguan in the bottom and you'll come to this page. This is the payment stage. Once you have seen the, pay uh, the number, the cost of the ticket, click this right here. Click and you'll see this information. The first row is your card pono, your card number. So whatever credit card or debit card you have, just put the numbers in there and you'll be good. And yuho kigan is the expiration date. So you'll do the month and the year. Now, the third row is your first two numbers of your like security code for your bank like the number you put in for the ATM. So it just has to be the first two numbers of it and next will be the injung pono. This is the last seven digits of your ARC card, your alien registration card. And all you have to do is put it in and that's pretty much it. Once you have finished, click the bottom right link that says Ibyok Wanyo to finalize reservation. Do not click the left one. Please do not click the left one or else you will have to start over. It says Tashi Ibyok, which means 
restart the process or restart the reservation. So click the bottom right. And once you have done that, you'll see your ticket and you'll be finished. And you'll have your ticket right there and there. And in order to see your ticket after you exit the app, you have to go to Sungchangwan Huagin. Click the top right and Huagin. Uh, because I didn't buy an app, or um, since I didn't buy a ticket, I can't look at one. But if you did purchase one via the app, click here. You'll type in your name, so la 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 in this case, and your password, 12345. And you'll click Huagin and you'll be able to see your ticket. It'll show you your departure time and your arrival time, your seating, um, the train number, and everything you need to know. Now it's like a virtual ticket. Uh, once you go on the train, you don't need to show your ticket to another person, but sometimes they do ask randomly. So if they do, just show them your phone and log in and show, show the virtual ticket and you should be good. Now, I hope this was very uh, informational for you guys. This is my first time making a video, so I'm sorry if it's not really professional looking. I tried my best, and I hope this gives you a easier way to like travel during your trips in Korea. Because waiting in line sucks. Like, reserving it online and then printing out a piece of paper and going to the line and trying to get your physical ticket just kind of sucks and sometimes the lines are long and you want to get there on time and I've been late on trains before and just it's really inconvenient so this way is probably the best way and if you ever want to just see if there's tickets available or tickets are running out you can just choose via the app and yeah thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this